good afternoon one and all today we will going to discuss about the antenna and its application so today we will going to discuss the herd antenna and microni type of the antenna in the herd antenna and microni antenna we will move one by one of its history construction introduction radiation pattern gain directivity application and comparison the herd antenna here is the herd antenna uh, history of the herd antenna and development of the herd antenna where to develop it basically the professor henrich hertz made the first radio transmission in 1886 in this laboratory of the karlsruhe university and the first antenna he is invented has its shape is as shown in figure it is the simple dipole type of the antenna and here in the dipole type of the antenna the whatever the signal is able to apply between the antenna i mean the 95% of its radiation should be occurred and its length is the lambda by 2 then next from this here the length having the radiating the signals uh, of this ends of this antenna by oscillating the signals and by oscillating the charges the wave is radiated and its strength is the 85% means there is 85% radiation should be happen with the help of this type of the antenna then next is its construction from this construction the dipole can be any length but it most commonly just under the half of the wavelength long and its dipole has an input impedance that is purely resistive lies between 30 to 80 ohm then its introduction the dipole length with half of the wavelength which is very small compared to its wavelength and that is about the 100 of its wavelength type its operating frequency the radiation pattern of the herd antenna is not a truly isotropic then its radiation pattern here is the radiation pattern the figure of a radiation pattern is obtained by using the herd type of the antenna then its gain and directivity gain of the herd antenna is 2.1 dB and the directivity is increases as the gain should be increases and uh, its polarization state is that generally the it is used for vertically polarized antenna antenna is placed perpendicular or vertically with the respect to the earth surface then application in the normally used for the small applications and was used in the set top tv channels then we move towards the microni type of the antenna it is the advanced version of the hertz type of the antenna and which is invented in the google google lemo uh, microni in 885 in the bolong bolonga and most common vertical antenna is known as the microni antenna in a microni antenna generally the monopole type of the antenna because the, it's a, another terminal is a connected to the ground and there is only one terminal is used for the radiation of the signal then its radiation pattern its radiation pattern mm, generally uh, radiation pattern of the microni type of the antenna is as shown in figure and its radiation resistance is equal to 36.5 then we have designed the microni type of the antenna having the length should be given 71 to 5 upon the frequency is in megahertz we have calculated the length of the microni type of the antenna then it is used in the radio broadcasting transmitters of the high power then comparison electrically and physically of the hertz antenna hertz antenna and microni antenna microni antenna is operates at hertz antenna means hertz antenna it is not used as a microni antenna but microni antenna operates as the hertz antenna it is only one quarter wavelength and uh, from this reference i would taken here thank you thank you very much i hope that uh, would you like to this video and uh, which is helpful for you any doubts any comment to write on my comment page and please subscribe my channel thank you